Today we're going to be talking about and showing people how recycling works in the terminal. So in the terminal, all off-aircraft waste is considered international waste and has to be disposed of either in a la licensed landfill or an incinerator. That's because we're trying to protect both our natural populations of wildlife and our agribusiness in Canada. But inside the terminal, we can recycle materials as appropriate, whether this be bottles of water, empty bottles, uh, newspapers, the paper towels that are used in the restaurant, and the organic waste in the restaurants. We're going to follow this bottle as it goes through the process. So all of our bins are clearly labeled recycling materials and waste materials. So this bottle is recyclable, so we're going to drop it in the recycling section. Now our cleaner is going to come in and take them out. This is where Lucy brings the garbage and the recycling material. This is one of our many uh, shoot rooms that will move the garbage and recycling material to an area where it's e more easily handled. Oh, here in the garbage room is Jesse. Hi there, I'm Jesse, Waste and Recycling Manager with URS Services. We are the company in charge of maintaining the uh, waste management and recycling programs. Our housekeeper Lucila here is going to throw her garbage directly down the garbage chute. We maintain the separation of the blue bagged recyclables uh, with a designated bin here. This is our waste collector, Jose. He's going to be, be beginning the second step of the separation process for the recyclables by bringing the blue bin downstairs to dispose of the bags into a larger bin. Now we're down here on the service level and Jose is going to finish off the second process of the separation of recyclables. This bin will then be collected by another one of our employees and brought to the recycling compactor which is then taken off site. Thank you very much Jesse, thank you. Thank you. Thanks for coming with us on a journey of recycling and waste in the terminal at Pearson.